Hey guys, decal 13 here, and welcome back to what should be the finale of Persona 5 Royal. Um, alright, so we're doing some last minute preparations for White Day. I'm going the wrong way already. Flower shop, flower shop, flower. Deli. Didn't realize there was a deli down here. Flower shop's over here. Oh, what brings you here today? Ah, here for a surprise present. Okay, leave it to me. That should do it. I tried to keep it as simple as possible. Okay, that comes out to... Hold on. Let me cover this one. You've been taking care of me yourself, so... You have money, Morgana? I need to express appreciation for you, too. Scarlet Rose. Good luck! I'm rooting for you! Thank you, Hanasaki. Okay, now you're all ready for the date. You know who you plan on inviting, right? Of course Don't I worry. do. I'm a gentleman who knows his manners. <laughs> I won't be tagging along. All right. Good luck out there. All right. Going to invite Sumire. Yes, Yoshizawa speaking. Let's go to Shinagawa. Get ready to head to Shinagawa. I met up with Sumeria at the aquarium. Oh, there are so many different kinds of fish. I'd never have realized just seeing them from a distance. They're all so beautiful. Come to think of it, I remember we had a family trip to an aquarium when I was younger. Kasumi was so excited to see the fish. But <laughs> apparently I was so scared I cried the whole time. Oh. How is it now? Oh, I'm having fun now. Hmm. Um, senpai, if I'm wrong, you can just tell me. But is this a date for White Day? Of course. I knew it. I'm so glad I got to spend it with you, senpai. Since we're on a nice date like this, though, we might as well have fun. Samaria seems pleased. Oh, wait. I think this is the end of the exhibit. Thank you for taking me out today. I'll be even more motivated for tomorrow's practice. Well, date's not over yet. Let's say we keep this going. What? Well, I suppose I'll take you up on that. Wow. This restaurant is beautiful. I'm impressed, Senpai. I hope you enjoy it. Of course! Oh, right. Inside voices. <laughs> Sorry about that. Love is so strange. I feel so happy when I'm with my boyfriend, but even tiny failures get me so depressed. As long as I've got you, though, I feel like I can get through anything. I feel the same way. Senpai, I'm glad we're on the same level, um, so to speak. <laughs> oh, uh, sorry. When should I give her the gift? Sorry about that. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for joining us on this special day. We wish you all an unforgettable evening. With one last finishing touch from us. Huh? Looks like something's happening. Wow. Oh, it's gorgeous. Dude, mentioning Sojiro's name gave us a spot this good? The man is unparalleled. A true god amongst men. I have a gift for you. What? Thank you so much. I never saw this coming, <laughs> but I'm so, so happy. 
I'm glad you like it. <laughs> You're going to spoil me, you know. I don't know if I even deserve to be this happy. Of course you do. I guess you put a lot of effort into this date. But I shouldn't have expected anything less, Senpai. You take care of everybody. And you always put their happiness before anything else. But I don't want this to be one-sided. One day, I want to take care of you like you do for me. Though, I guess that might not be for a while. <laughs> I look forward to it. Thank you. It'll definitely happen eventually. So please be patient. Okay, maybe I'm getting a little <laughs> too worked up about it. Um... We still have some time left tonight, so... Can I stay with you just a little longer? Samira and I spent some time alone together. Once it got late, I walked her back to the station. Ooh. I, I, I gotta be sure to really, really thank boss! <laughs> Holy shit! Hey. Finally taking off tomorrow. Yeah, I am. So Jiro said you don't have to help out here today. Go and see your friends before you leave. Okay. Off you go then. Try not to cry. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Futaba. <laughs> How sweet of you. John passed her high school entrance exam. She sent me a message this morning. I told her I was getting into high school too, and she says we can make our student debuts together. So, you know that promise in the book? The one about going to school? This means, like, I did it, right? Yeah, you did. I'll think about a reward. Ooh, sounds good to me. <laughs> And I've got something else to look forward to. It had better be good. Don't let me down. <laughs> Honestly, though, the idea of not having Sojiro or everyone else around is the scariest part. But I know I can't stay in my room forever. And that's way more important. I feel like I've been getting more curious every day. I want to see and learn so much stuff. So I want you to have this. It's proof I'm moving on. Because I only changed this much thanks to the notebook. And you, of course. If you ever feel lonely, just look at this notebook and remember that I've got your back. Okay? Saying goodbye to me? Oh, cut it out. You're gonna see me tomorrow. Just remember to pack once you get back, dear. I don't want you forgetting anything important here. <laughs> that reminds me. Maybe I should give Sojiro my probation diary. Let's do it. Oh, yeah. I forgot about this. The Diary of the Phantom Thieves Leader, huh? Probably gonna be worth a lot someday. Man, don't sell it. I'm trying to be I'm trying to be emotional here. Thanks, though. I'll keep it safe. Well, we've all been through a lot, but it seems like everything's changed for the better. Try to behave yourself back home, would you? <laughs> Not like you ever listened to me anyway. Recipe notes. Here, I want you to have these. I've got them memorized already. With that stuff, you can make the same... Well, no, that'd be a waste. Put your own spin on the flavor. Develop it. Make it yours. Come on, you should get going. You still got things to do, right? Yeah. <sighs> you know... Playing through this game again, I didn't think I'd have these feelings again. You look like you're doing well. But it's starting to kick in that it's over. And I'm starting to feel really sad again. <sighs> I decided to stop by after work. I used to come by this area on occasion. I was always a fan of LeBlanc's coffee. It's tomorrow, right? The day you go home? Care for some coffee? I appreciate the offer. But I imagine you've got other things to attend to. On the record, you've been cleared of all the crimes you were accused of. 
Unfortunately, the stigmas that came with them are a little harder to simply wipe away. Yeah, that's true. You might find that even now, sometimes it'll feel like the whole world's against you. So, just in case, take this. Whenever you need help, I'll be on your side. Remember that. I'll be doing my part to bring some real justice to our legal system. Can't rely on the Phantom Thieves forever. Oh, hey. You're going home tomorrow, right? Then let me give you an update. So, about Miwachan, her symptoms started fading pretty soon after administering the new medicine. That's great. You can see her smile now. Yeah, I can't wait. It's all thanks to you. Thank you for supporting me through it all. Same goes for the situation with Oyamata. You did everything you could to help me with it. I don't know where all that devotion comes from. Maybe I should take a cue from you. Here. I want you to have this. You saved Miwachan. It's only fair that you get to meet her someday. Let's see. Once Miwachan's all better, maybe the both of us could take a trip to visit you. Sounds like fun. <laughs> Keep your health in check. I want you there to welcome us with a smile, okay? Ooh, we got a lot of people in Shibuya. Juku, no one Kichi Joji, Ifumi and Kanda, Shinya and Mishima and Akihabara, and I think that's everyone. Oh well, at the school, Makoto and Kawakami. All right, let's head to Shibuya next. Let's not some of the NPCs, might as well. Could you tell me what you remember most about this year? Phantom Thieves. Even after the disappearance, the Phantom Thieves seem to have lasted a left a lasting impression. The world may be going through a tumultuous time, but I can still feel a strong sense of conviction. Today's youth are undoubtedly growing up. That's all for our on-the-spot on coverage. You haven't changed at all, even after going freelance. I'll follow you anywhere. Hmm? New year, new students. Wonder what the fresh meat will be like this time, buddy. Yeah, about that. I'm quitting the club. I didn't come to college to play around. You gotta work on your jokes, bro. Never make that pose again, man. Wait, are you for real? Hey, hey. You're heading home tomorrow, I hear. It'll be a new start. You've got my blessing, whatever that's worth. I recall the days. When you help me out with my speeches here. You'll always have my support. We'll be treading separate paths. But as long as we share a common purpose, I'm sure I'll see you again. If I've earned the support of an upright young man like you, well, that must surely be my greatest achievement. You expect farewells to be so sad, but here we are beaming. From now on, your life is your own to live. Now, I suppose I'd better send you off with a parting gift. It's an incredibly expensive fountain pen I bought back when I'd strayed from the right path. Embarrassingly enough, I hardly used it. I hope you'll put it to better use than I did. Whatever new chapters you write with that pen, I'll be watching for them. Quite a few people on Central Street. Oh, Haru. Oh? It's a little strange meeting here. And that reminds me, the new coffee shop venture is progressing toward opening its first location. Actually, I'll be involved with its launch even while attending college. I love to enjoy a cup. I love to go enjoy a cup. We do have plans to expand into other regions. Perhaps one may pop up in your town. <laughs> From now on, I'll have to balance my studies and the company. No easy task, I'm sure. 
But it's all for the sake of making my dream come true. I swear I'll make this work. By the way, I tried making something for you. I'd like to sell handcrafted goods at my cafe as well. So this is the first step in my practice. I want to live up to my grandfather's reputation after all, and my father's legacy. It has to be a comforting, welcoming place for everyone. Some place to spend your peaceful hours. Once it opens, we should all meet up there. Just like our days at Leblanc. So, you have come to say farewell. I have some words of reflection for you in this time of parting. This twisted, broken world sought to crush you, yet you salvaged it, and with your ideals stitched it whole. You were a true trickster of this modern age, a beloved champion of a burdened public, and a man of such great heights. Well, where will his path take him next, I wonder? Care to join me? Now, I don't know about that. To accompany a trickster on so twisting and winding a path, I fear I'd soon be outpaced. I have more than mere words to give you today, though. Allow me to grant you a parting gift. Not as the one who leads you, but simply as Lavenza. This is my blessing to you, to carry on your journey. You were confined to yourself for so long, now at last it seems only right that you bear its key. In the past, guests of the Velvet Room have received their keys upon their very first visits. That's true. However, I was unable to pass it on to you at that point. This is the least I can do for you now. With this key in hand, you will be able to break free of whatever trials may imprison you in the future. Though of course, you have already chosen the path of true freedom. By inspiring others to take up arms and fight for their own beliefs, you may change the world itself. You walk the path of a true trickster. May it lead you to fortune beyond imagining. Yeah. Oh, there's Kauru. I hear you're heading home tomorrow. Perfect. I got a story for you. Kauru got accepted to high school. He'll be a Shujin Academy student in the spring. Ah, that's good to hear. He'll be in good hands. Thanks, man. Karu will be stoked when I tell him. He says he wants to become like you. Well, being a bro means someone will be following in your footsteps. But I can't leave everything to you. I'm the parent here, so I gotta do my job. <laughs> oh, yeah, here. It's an EY family gecko. Take good care of it. Okay. Can't go pin. Having you around the place helped me realize times sure have changed. But I'm not going obsolete just yet. I still got more to learn, just like you. Looks like you got plenty of guys following your lead now. I'm real glad we met. Take care. Kasuna-san, I'm glad I could see you. Dad's told me today's your last day here, so I really needed to talk to you. What's wrong? Oh, sorry, I just had to tell you this in person. Starting the spring, I'll be a Shujin student. I know I said I admired the Phantom Thieves, but I think you're amazing too, Kasuna-san. I want to be just like you. I figured I could start by going to the same school as you. Good luck. Thanks. Oh shoot, I forgot I was in charge of dinner today. Sorry, I've got to go. Gotta catch a sale before it ends. Talk to you later. Oh, Takikuma. Yes, I ranked up again. Never thought I'd be I'd get this far playing legit. Maybe I don't need the cheats after all. He's so focused on the game he hasn't noticed me. I can see Takikuma too. Yo? Man, spring break's supposed to be the most fun part of the year, but instead you're just moving away. Hey, you're moving soon too. Then again, so am I. I guess this is probably the last time we'll be meeting up here. 
I'll never forget you, Ryuji. Dude, I say it like that. <laughs> you make it sound like I'm gonna die or something. Look, this isn't gonna be the last time we see each other. I'll come visit whenever you want. Honestly, even with the rehab, I don't know if my leg's ever gonna be how it was before. But when I think about how much I want to run, well, I figure there's no point lying to myself. Nothing's guaranteed. I don't know if I'm gonna get anywhere, but well, you could say that for any goal, right? It's true. I don't want to live stuck on regrets or shame. I, I'd rather just run and keep on running. And hey, you better practice too. See, if we share our times, we can even compete from far away. And when I think about going to school without you guys, I don't know. I can't imagine it. It's nice feeling like I got a future worth looking forward to for once, though. And it's all thanks to you, man. Alright, where are we heading next? Oh, well, let's go see you, Sky. Oh. That's right. You'll be departing tomorrow. It's sad to see this as a season of farewells, but I didn't expect we'd all go our separate ways. Yeah, really. Took me by surprise, too. It was one hell of a year. <laughs> That's putting it mildly. <laughs> this time last year, I'd never have imagined I'd meet you all, leave my home, or become a phantom thief. Do you remember the painting I submitted to that competition? Desire and hope it was. Well, I would like to bestow it upon you as a parting gift. Oh. As of now, my canvas is still blank. It's not for lack of inspiration. There's so much I want to express, I can barely contain my passion. But my heart has not led me astray yet. I'll paint as it guides me. Even should I scar my work with doubt, hesitation, chaos. Certainly, that's a beauty all its own. Your life is no worse for its own scars. Your truest beauty lies in them. And I hope you tell me their stories someday. Oh, did you come here for souvenirs? This place has everything. I'm busy getting ready for my study abroad, too. We've gotta research schools, places to live, but we're all splitting off to do our own thing, huh? Honestly, it's not really hitting me yet. <laughs> me neither. I mean, it makes sense. We stuck with each other through all the freaky stuff last year. By the way, um, a little girl stopped me the other day in Shibuya. Oh? She said she saw me in magazines. And that she wants to be just like me when she grows up. It felt incredible. Aww. Oh, right. Vague did a special piece on me in this month's issue. I said it all in the interview, but I'm going to work hard. One day, I'll be modeling across the world. I've got to reach people. I want to give someone hope, like you did for me. Thank you for all you've done. The days I spent with you were some of the brightest in my life. Once I'm a star, I'm gonna shine even brighter, though. So you watch out for me! It's everyone in Shibuya. I guess next is the school. Well, the station platform. And the school gate. I see Makoto over there. I want to see something real quick with the items. So, and key items. So, these unlock skills when you start up the confidence in the next playthrough. So, on starts with sexy technique and crocodile tears. Yusuke allows for the skill card copying. Ryuji's Harrison recovery and stealth dash. It's Harrison recovery. That's a weird one. I thought we'd get insta kill, but. Eh, sure, Harrison recovery. All customizations unlocked. All Velvet Remorden features unlocked, Soil Improvement unlocked, All Speech Abilities, Allows uh, all items to be sold at the clinic, Size does nothing, Always make the best coffee and curry, 
Treasure reboot and memento scan unlocked. Ooh, 100 SP. I know the, the Valentine's chocolates carry over too. Fully restores SP. some of my college enrollment papers ready. Soon enough, I'll be living on my own, too. <laughs> New beginnings for both of us, I suppose. I'll be rooting for you. Thanks. You'd better take care of yourself back home, too. My sister and I are actually going to look at my new place soon. Oh. A year ago, all this would have been unthinkable for me. But nobody told me to do this. It's a path I chose for myself. If I'd never met you, and stayed a simple honor student, I'd never realized I had that choice. So, I want you to have this. It helped me learn to love studying. Aw, cute Buchimaru calculator. One day, I'll be a police commissioner. I know it won't be easy, but I also know I'll never give up. By giving this to you, I want to prove that. We fought back together, so it seems only fair you keep it. I want you to know that you're an irreplaceable comrade to me. Aoyama always have been, always will be. Train doors are now closing. Please stand back. Oh, knock out against Keishi. Oh, Kazuna. So, did Sakamoto tell you again? Tell you yet? He's gonna be doing track again. That guy's crazy. Sounds like he's going to go. He's going right into physical rehab once he's all settled in after the move. Man, I'm just glad I'll get to run with him again. We're gonna help his, with his comeback however we can. Guy's a hell of a runner after all. I hope we can find ways to support him. Yeah. Point is, you don't have to worry about him. Even if you end up moving back to your hometown, he'll still have guys looking out for him. I know it'll be hard to get used to, but don't let it get you down. Aww. You guys really came around on Ryuji. Oh. What a coincidence. I'm about to give a lecture. Did you come to see the campus? You're going back home tomorrow, right? Make sure you keep up your studies there, okay? Thanks for everything. Of course. And let me know if there's anything you need. This is the last time we'll see each other for a while. You can at least look a little sad about it. <laughs> I'm kidding. Honestly, seeing you so happy gives me peace of mind. Now that you're heading out into the world, I've got a present for you. It sounds like the setup to a joke. A student bumps into his teacher in a full French maid outfit. <laughs> but somehow, that opened up all kinds of new paths in my life. You taught me so much. You're not just my best student. You were a great master. I can make up for all the times I distanced myself from my students. I'll help anyone who needs it. The point is, I'll put in the work. I learned a lot from you, and I won't let that go to waste. That place is left are Kanda and Akihabara, right? Oh, and Shinjuku. I didn't see Sumeri at all. I wonder why not. Oh, you came to visit. You're going home tomorrow, correct? To tell you the truth, I have an important shogi tournament tomorrow as well. Oh. Yeah, I'll be cheering you on. Thank you very much. If I do well, that will make it ten straight wins. I'll work hard so I can give you a good report. That's quite a smile. Like a knight standing victorious at the end of a grand siege. <laughs> but I suppose a knight can't remain idle for too long. His presence is still needed elsewhere, I take it. If my shogi skills have truly helped such a dauntless champion, then it has been an honor and a pleasure. From one player to another, I have a parting gift for you. The lance piece moves exclusively forward. Until it is promoted, it can only move onward, never back. So let us continue on our own paths. 
even if we have to part ways for now. One day, when the two of us lances have been promoted, we will retrace our steps and meet again. Shima. Oh, so you're finally heading home tomorrow, huh? I guess this means the Phantom Thieves have disbanded. My documentary script is going well, though. It's not really close to done, but it's coming along. Yeah, that's a start. <laughs> What's the title? Huh? Uh, well, I haven't really gotten to that. I've been too busy actually writing it. But when I need one, I'll definitely be consulting the ex Phantom Thieves themselves. Makes me wonder how many people I can reach with my work. It's exciting, but kind of scary, too. It might be a bestseller, or it might just fade into obscurity. <laughs> but I want to put my hope into this. It's a message from the old me to everyone in the world. So, even if I'm scared of failing, I'll face this head on. Just like you did with that first calling card. Oh, yeah. It's still a pretty early draft, but... It'd mean a lot if you could read it sometime. I could really use your feedback. You probably had tons of crazy fights I don't even know about, right? So, we should sit down and talk about them sometime. The more of it I get on record, the better. I'll make sure the story of the Phantom Thieves goes down in history. Thanks, Mishima. Oh, Starlina. <laughs> I was wondering why that woman looked a bit more uh, defined than the other people around. That would explain it. Hey, uh, you're moving tomorrow, right? Don't forget to practice at home. <laughs> hey, you keep working hard too. Yeah, whatever happens from now on, I'm gonna keep winning too. If I lose, then I'll deal with it. Just like you taught me. Oh, right. I returned the money, and he forgave me. We're friends now, and he's even playing gun about with me. He's still a total newbie, so I'm teaching him all the pro strats. <laughs> oh, but don't stress. It's not all boot camp this time. I'm going easier on him. Thanks for everything. You've helped me so much. I'm going to give you my secret weapon. Gun controller. See, that's my strategy. I use this to practice at home. But these days I'm kind of too busy helping mom or playing with my friends. At first, I thought you were kind of weird, but now, uh, you seem pretty cool. So, <laughs> I'm still your teacher when it comes to games, but you're my teacher in real life. Oh, Shinya. I really like Shinya. It's a good kid. All right. Two left. That should do it. Lorenzo's well, here too. Oh, it's exactly as the card said. You came to visit me. In your current state, you should be fine. <laughs> You'll be fine too. <laughs> well, if you're the one saying that, then it must be true. I've been receiving encouragement from my clients lately, even though I should be the one encouraging them. Strange, isn't it? <laughs> but perhaps that's the truest form of fortune telling there is. Mutually encouraging each other to find happiness in a world full of tangled, painful fates. It's the kind of comfort I've always hoped to provide in my readings. Here, this card represents your future. Please. Take it as a good luck charm. Fortune tarot card. An upright fortune card represents happiness to come, but it's an omen of doom when reversed. But I know you'll carry on with the same conviction you've always had. You are never one to fear the future. That's how you manage to bring joy to any fate. So, I'm sure we'll meet again. Though, that's not based on any augury. Just a personal wish. That's unfair. Uh, I don't think so. Hmm. Oh, honey. What brings you here at a time like this? Do 
you have ESP? Huh? I'm surprised you knew where I was. Are you here to say goodbye? I mean, it's it's the middle of the day. Why wouldn't I think you'd be at the bar? <laughs> I wanted to thank you. That's my line. So, I'm close to being able to report on Kaio's case. Ever since all that stuff happened with Shido, the stories haven't stopped rolling in. But it looks like I can finally avenge her. And it's all thanks to your hard work. Here, it's a record of the struggles we shared. By the way, I heard the Phantom Thieves are disbanding? It's gonna be so boring around here. <laughs> Not every day you get to chase after a bunch of young revolutionaries like them. Hold on, though. I bet you got more tricks up your sleeve. You're going home, not turning over a new leaf. <laughs> I'll be keeping an ear out for your next adventure, okay? I promise, I'll tell your story to the world. <laughs> Look forward to it. Oh. There's a fire in your eyes now, boy. I have to say, it suits you. Come back anytime. Come back to this bar once you become an adult. I'll break out some of my finest drinks for you. Thanks, Lala Chan. Come again. Take care. Watch out for any weirdos on your way home, okay? I'm pretty sure that's everyone. I'm not missing. I'm not missing anything. Doesn't look like I am. I wonder if I head to these different places. Because there are some other places that I have available to me. Oh, Kaonabe! Kazuna-kun? It's been a while. I just got a call from Kitago-kun. He said he's found the new theme he wishes to paint. Do you mean... Yes, he didn't give me the details, but I was able to pick up the gist of it. Something about friendship. <laughs> I'm so excited I can hardly contain it. Rather unbecoming of a person my age, I know. But still. I'm sure you understand, though. Whatever it is he comes up with, it's sure to be a masterpiece. I can very much look forward to the day I can see it. I should say goodbye to Kaonabe and go elsewhere. Go to Seaside Park. Oh, Mika. Mika-chan, could you look this way, please? Right here! Sure, how's this? Yes, yes, that's perfect! Oh, you're absolutely radiant today, as always. Thanks a bunch! You're too kind. What do you want? <laughs> of course I am. Not like I'm going to let myself lose to a certain other dolt. Just you watch. I'm going to work my way up to the top. Uh, did you say something, Mika-chan? Uh, nothing at all. So what pose do you want me to do next? Mika's busy doing a shoot right now. I should look somewhere else. <laughs> well, let's go over to Kichijoji. It's worth a look around at least. I don't think I'm going to see anything though. having kind of a hard time believing it's all over. I don't want it to be over, guys. I want to keep going. Well, I guess it has to end. Oh, Takakura! Oh, you're Harus. I see, the schools are all on spring break. Why are you here? <laughs> I just happen to know some of the cafes around here. I often take strolls in this area on my breaks. Everyone needs time to relax once in a while, both adults and children alike. Especially Haru. She does have a, de a tendency to stretch herself too thin. I'd like to ask that you occasionally spend this kind of time with her. Unhurried with just the two of you. Just leave it to me. Good answer. I have complete confidence that I can entrust her to you. Hmm? It's really cool you get to see the people from, uh... Just like the social links and everything hanging around. Well, I think that's really it. I mean, I don't see anyone else waiting around. Really anything else to do. So I guess...
Let's head back home. So, Have you said oh. all your goodbyes? Yeah. Are you really sure? Let's go home. Hey, um, I actually have a present for you, too. Oh. Even when I was human, I kept holding on to this for some reason. Between a cat, a human, or some kind of vehicle. It's been hard to say for sure who or what I am, but whatever else I am, I can say without a doubt, I'm your partner. Well then, we should probably go home and get packed, huh? Yeah. You finished saying your goodbyes? Well, how'd it go? Did it make you feel like you want to stay? <laughs> of course. I see. You must have made a lot of good memories here. You're leaving early tomorrow from Shibuya, right? Make sure you pack up before you head to sleep. Oh, and take that stupid cat with you. I don't want her getting lost and ending up back here. <laughs> don't make fun of me. I can go wherever I want all by myself. Huh. It really never stops meowing, huh? Hey, Futaba, what's he saying? Is he sad that he has to leave me? He said, Sojiro's stupid. <laughs> Damn, Futaba. What? <laughs> what kind of translation is that? Let me have a nice goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> Mona's your responsibility now. Leave Sojiro to me. <laughs> Isn't that the other way around? Not true. I'll take really good care of him. Oh man. <laughs> Even if you're not here, I'll make sure I do my best. So you go do your best too. I will. <sighs> Thank you for everything. Hey, you got everything? I took you in. I thought I was the one helping you. But it turns out it was the other way around. Take care. You too. Don't be so cheeky. Oh, and sorry. I wanted to have Futaba see you off too. I haven't been able to find her since this morning, though. Same with that cat. If you end up back in the city, come on by. I'll at least treat you to a nice cup of coffee. Wait, that means I can't go closing this door, huh? I guess not. What are you doing? Hurry up and go. Thank you for everything. Yeah. He's parked on the sidewalk. <laughs> <laughs> after we said hmm? we'd disband. We are all in break after all. No more entrance exams. Mm. I can drive you to the station. You really, really gotta go? Uh. Shit. <laughs> Jeez. They've even followed us here? You gotta be what kidding we me. Do? Hmm? Need a hand? Hmm? Hmm? What? Dr. Maruki? Pardon me? 
You're suggesting uh -huh. we split up? <laughs> Should we? <laughs> <laughs> All right, Doc. Here we go. Bye! Come and get us. <laughs> <laughs> Shall we then? Glad he's still okay. There's no charge. Oh. If you find yourself struggling in life, you can start over, like me. Remember that. So yeah, if that ends up saving you, then we're square. Good luck. <sighs> Jesus, guys. <laughs> Damn, man. Those dudes just wouldn't give up. Wish it went smoother, but hmm? I guess this is it. Be sure to eat well. We'll see you soon, right? If you don't come back, we'll find you there. <laughs> All right, it's mm -hmm. time. Yeah. Aw, gotta go already? We don't make the train schedule. See you later, my dude! I'll text you, okay? Come on, sit down. <laughs> I'm gonna they found him again. <laughs> Jeez, you guys. Oh, oh, Smire. You taught me to keep my head up, didn't you? <laughs> <laughs> Told you I was coming with you. Ooh. <laughs> Take care. I guess that does it, but <laughs> just keeps going, huh? <sighs> yeah, I guess that's it. <sighs> Man. Ah, uh, what do I say? This this was incredible. I'm gonna say it flat out, as someone who's played the original Persona 5, um, god, this was a fucking treat. If you, if you guys have watched this far, or if you're just tuning in for the finale for some reason, um, if you've played P5 already and you're still on the fence about this game, check it out. Pick it up. It's, it's well worth it. Like, even from just like all the original stuff, this game adds so much that it's honestly almost like an entirely new experience. Like, I, I loved every minute of this. I mean, of course I had some troubles, as usual. <laughs> um, but yeah, you know. No, I just trying to reach the cat place, but she's too short. <laughs> Poor Haru. Uh Glad to see this new like epilogue between pe everyone too. Oh! <laughs> Almost fell out of her chair. Oh, <sighs> uh, no, th this was... This was incredible, honestly. I... I love this a lot. All the new stuff they added in, the new characters, the new confidant with a catchy too. Like, I loved it. It was it was a lot of fun. 
and I really hope you guys enjoyed, uh, for those of you who've watched all the way through, uh, thank you for doing so, by the way, and I really hope you guys enjoyed this as much as I did, because I had so much fun just recording this, sitting down every day to record this for, how, how many weeks have I been recording this for? <laughs> it's a good question, now that I think about it. Uh, but no, it's, uh... Uh, it's been great. Yeah, because now, now that I'm thinking about it, every day for, uh... Every day for about... How long? For about, like, a month, almost. Maybe a less than that. Um... Yeah, I've just been, every day since I, when I get home from work, I just sat down, recorded for a couple hours, had lunch, went back to recording, had dinner, recorded, then I went to sleep, repeated the same thing over and over again. I will admit, I, I've been a bit tired at work lately, and hopefully now that this is off of my plate, I won't be as exhausted as I was before. Um... Yeah. I, I don't know why I'm at such a loss for words. I, I, I honestly don't know what to say. Like, part of me still believes, like, oh, it's not over. There's still something else. But no, I'm, I'm watching the credits roll. And I, I said it a couple episodes back, but I am incredibly surprised by how much I was able to get done on a first playthrough. I never do this well on a first playthrough of a Persona game. It's like, thinking back to like when I first played P4 Golden, when I first played Persona 3, like even when I do like fresh files nowadays, I can never max everything out. Even the first P5, I didn't max every- I didn't get everything maxed out on my first playthrough. I mean, not that you guys saw it, because, you know, I had to cancel that halfway through, because the recording got fucked to high hell and back, but... Regardless. Um... Yeah, I'm, I'm just incredibly surprised. I had enough time to max out my social stats, max out the confidants, get most of the fucking trophies, um... And still have time to spare, including getting all the uh, third-tier evolutions for the Personas, too. Like, that was incredible, that's incredible to me, that I was able to get so much done. And I, I did all the twin hangouts, the one with Lavenza. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm, I'm really happy. I'm really happy with, uh, how I went, how things went this playthrough. Uh... Now, I, I, I'm pro pretty sure someone's gonna be complaining, like, Oh, you played through most of the game on normal mode. Like, th where was the challenge? Well, first, I said it before. I wanted to get the new content as quickly as I could. Although I realized probably 100 hours is not as quickly as I could. Um. <laughs> uh, but anyway. You know, I wanted to preserve some, like... What am I trying to say? I don't know, I, I didn't want to be like some people playing through the game who just buy Magatsui's and- I mean, who buy, uh, Iznagi no Okami out of the compendium immediately and just start fucking myriad truthing everything in their fucking path. Like, I wanted to have fun with it. And I did. I had a hell of a lot of fun with it. Especially when I was able to make Atis. <laughs> that- that was easily the highlight of the, my playthrough. Creating that was so satisfying the moment I made Atis. I was so happy with it. And the ability that I was able to get Almighty Amp on it, too. Because I remember I made something through uh, Online Fusion. And I saw the bonus skill pop up. I see Almighty Amp. I'm like, oh shit, I have to, I have to somehow get this on Atis. <laughs> that was actually the next thing I made after Atis. Because I, I made Atis during the Fusion Alarm. So... I actually saved and re-rolled that quite a few times just so I could get Almighty Amp. <laughs> uh, no, hey, it worked out though. 
I'm, I'm happy with it. <laughs> I don't even remember what I was making, but I know it, it turned out to be a fusion accident, but I still got Almighty Ant from it, so I, I was happy with it. Ugh. These are some real disorganized final thoughts, I realize. But, uh... I mean, aren't my final thoughts usually all this all, like, disorganized and shit? <laughs> I feel like that's how things always go whenever I end something off. I can never do it eloquently and professionally. It's always me bumbling along. Although... <laughs> I guess that's really me in a nutshell, huh? I never do things eloquently and professionally. It's just me fucking around until... Oh, hey, it's over. <laughs> uh... But now, like, like I said before, I really hope you guys did enjoy this playthrough, because I enjoyed it so much. Um, as of right now, though, I have a shit ton of it. I have a shit ton of this per, pl uh, playthrough to edit together. I think, right, let's see, I've edited together episode 30, and that's what I've uploaded right now. So I have about 70 videos to get through. I really should have been, like, chipping away at it every day. At least 70 episodes, I should say. I don't know how, how long this project ended up turning out right now. Definitely more than 100 episodes, though. I'll have to check the final count myself after I'm done recording this. But, whew, I'm, I'm not looking forward to tearing through all this shit. <laughs> that, that's that's going to be a lot of fun to put together. But hey, you know. Oh, special thanks to all Persona 5 Royal players. Uh, this this was a this was a fantastic experience. I, I enjoyed this so much. I actually liked how they changed the ending too, uh, with how everyone's going their separate ways, everyone's growing up, moving on. I think that's a really nice ending. Some people might not like it, but I think it's really good. Still got something else afterwards, after credit scene, or are we done here? Oh. Phone call. Oh. Hmm? Um. Catchy live. I'm actually really happy about that. I'm happy now. Call call me a basic bitch, but I like when everything has a nice happy ending attached to it. All right, I I'm basic as fuck. I'm sorry. I I like the sappy end. I like the sappy happy ending. <laughs> so yeah oh, but yeah I guess that's everything now everyone turned out happy we didn't need Maruki's altered reality in the end we just need to make our own reality ours oh actually I shouldn't have saved this over this I should have saved this over uh... I should save this over here that's what I should do All right, so I guess on that note, that'll do it for Persona 5 Royal. As I've said countless times already, I really hope you guys enjoyed, and I'm really hope- here's hoping, fingers crossed, as of the day I'm recording this, they have not announced Persona 5 Scramble coming to the US yet. Hopefully they do that sometime soon. I'd really like to play that in English. But, you know, that's up to Atlas, and who knows when the fuck they're going to do it. Um, but yeah, thank you all so much for watching this playthrough. I really hope you guys had a good time. I had such a fun time doing this. And I hope you guys stick around and see what I'm doing next. So, I will see you all then. Bye!